Daniel had a very difficult birth and as a consequence he got cerebral palsy. So it wasn't a big surprise to us when he was two years old and still wasn't able to stand upright and walk unassisted. And it was at this point of time that Daniel's physiotherapist suggested that he would start wearing orthotics. Problem was that the hospital had over a year's wait list and Daniel needed his orthotics straight away. The current waiting list it could take up to um, eight months to get to see an orthotist. For some audit with a turnaround from the start, from casting to finish, it's about around 12 weeks. It depends on the complexity of the clients and the uh, volumes of work we got. The new approach um, has the potential to be faster, more efficient, um, less distressing for the child. The technology has the capability to bridge that geographical divide and give isolated families access to the same opportunities. Over the last 18 months, we've spent over a thousand hours talking to people with disabilities, 300 hours talking to manufacturers and clinicians, 50 hours talking to funding bodies, including the NDIS, and we've had eight co-creation events and created over a dozen prototypes. The new technology means that you can scan the limb just as it is, and then the technology um, combined with the expertise of the orthotist um, is what can create the right angle or the right degree of flexion and extension of the joint to then just manufacture um, without the stress and distress of the traditional method. For the technology. For community. For the people. For families.